How's it going everyone and welcome back to the enclave. So obviously we're still on the outdoor range. Uh, the day is progressing, progressing, sorry, and I am getting sweatier. So today's video, we are going to be testing out the old adage of gangster shooting, I suppose, versus traditional sport shooting or self-defense shooting, I suppose, as we tend to train. So what we're going to be doing is basically a bull drill, both styles, so sideways and traditional proper grip. And we will then be doing a Mozambique drill, also traditional grip and then the, uh, the grip of the streets, I suppose. Then I guess we have two targets set up at the bottom here, two IDPA targets. The one on the left is going to be proper traditional shooting and the one on the right is going to be our alternative shooting. So without any further ado let's get into the intro and then we will get into the shooting. Okay, so we are back. We are going to be starting off with the bull drill, which I'm actually a little bit far away from. So, as always, bull drill, if you saw that video, draw six rounds in A zone as quickly as possible. Okay, so let us get into, first off, traditional bull drill. So we have that, fabulous, and then we can move over to our right target and attempt to do the non-traditional of, <laughs> style of fire, sorry. Okay, I must admit I've never shot like this before. <laughs> Let's give it a go. Ooh, getting my spike. Picture was quite difficult there. <laughs> oh, I'm not used to trying to find a site uh, sideways. Interesting. Okay, so that is our bull drill. Let's go and have a look at the targets. So starting off obviously with our non-traditional method, we've got Obviously, a horizontal spread here, which is something we don't tend to see. Our spreads tend to go up and down with our recoil. But obviously, because the firearm was sideways, we ended up with a horizontal spread. But all on target, which I'll be honest, was more than I was expecting. But I did try and find my sights. So in a normal setup, that wouldn't really happen. Then we have here our traditional ball. So as you can see, still all six holes but vertical climb, not horizontal climb. And I feel like that's pretty good. It's all within a fist. It's not perfect, but it's actually not so bad. And as we can see there, quite a difference between the two styles of shooting. So I'm going to patch up the targets. Maybe I'm not. Nah, I won't patch up the targets. We are just going to load some ammo and then we will be back for the Mozambique draw. Okay, so here we are with the Mozambique drill section of our traditional versus non-traditional shooting, I suppose. So, as always, two to the chest, one to the head, as quick as possible. So, let's go. Okay, that was a bit slow, but hey. Now with this, what I'm going to do is basically fire as soon as the firearm is in the direction of my intended target. I realized with the bull drill, I actually spent a lot of time acquiring a sight picture, which 
obviously somewhat defeats the purpose. We're not trying to be accurate. We're trying to just hose down everybody on the sidewalk, I suppose. So let's go. As soon as I think I can hit the target, we go hit the target. Okay. So I suppose let's have a look, see what we got. And uh, it's not looking so good for the uh, for the gangster here. He uh, he apparently missed the entire gosh darn target, which uh, that's not good to see, guys. That's not good to see at all. He's alive and well. He's having some crawfish with his family, and over here we have what I would call a uh, a person who's not making it home to dinner tonight, at at the very least. Um, maybe he's gonna make it, but I highly doubt it. So I guess there we have the difference between taking a bit of time, getting a good side picture versus just popping off, man. Obviously, we do train to be accurate for a reason. We, uh, we're not just out here spraying bullets downrange. Um, that is obviously one of the things I mentioned in one of the previous videos, we've actually had problems here at the outdoor range because people just spray wily nally. So as you can see, it's obviously far more effective to be doing proper grips, proper side pictures, side alignments, versus just, uh, you know, wily nally going for as many rounds as you can get down range. So yeah, I hope you've enjoyed the video. And as always, please like, comment, share, subscribe. And if you got more time, maybe check out another video here at the end. And as always, peace out.